are determined to gain at least one point at this FIFA Under-17 Women's World Cup. Nigeria are targeting top spot in Group A, and just a point will do for them. Nigeria. There's the blue FIFA flag for the game, for the world, is the message, and the yellow flag of fair play. Next out, the officials, led by the referee Michelle Pai of Canada. And then Nigeria today in all white with green trimmings. So what about Nigeria? Well, they make changes for this one. The first appearance of the tournament for Kiyoma Alimba and Ebere Okoye. In addition, third choice goalkeeper Joki Zangonuga plays as both Arima Abu and Damilola Akano. A goal in each game so far in this FIFA Under-17 Women's World Cup. Well, that's lovely skill and a decent cross as well. Great work from Francisca Ortega. And get the feeling the Nigerians are going to enjoy themselves tonight. That's a lovely turn. OK, so the shot goes a long way wide from Lovit Ayila. He's got a very good goal against Trinidad and Tobago. But what a good turn that was. Just needed a better finish. In the end, a good bit wide. This throw was taken by Akinbai. He's a Kobe. Thank you. And Ortega. Putting it away after it was spilled by the stretching goalkeeper. Sometimes have problems when they come up against other nations, perhaps from the America, from North America. We'll just see what. Uh, Ayila can do here. Ayila with the cross. This time it's properly held by Veronica Seiss. There's an element of the same sort of thing with Chile, where Chile have... Well, we've made mention of the goalkeeper Veronica Seiss and how sometimes she does struggle. That's a lovely touch. Confident stuff. The love it, Ayila. Torres starting to, or trying to start the move there. Oh, there's plenty of running in the legs of Flore Faiula. Popping up on both wings as it suits this spell of possession. Delightfully done by Odega. Made a good goal if Ayila could have got on the end of it. Ayila in on goal, and Ayila makes it to well, the little ball forward from Francisca Ortega was the key to this goal, but it wasn't a bad finish either from Lovic Ayila of Adamaya Queens. Oh, she's got a really good goal against Trinidad and Tobago. Smalley, they call her. And Lois Ayila has now got her second of the tournament. <laughs> defenders were a little bit absent. And Ayila nipped into the gap to make it Chile near Nigeria. by Torres. <laughs> 2 nil. Somehow, Odea didn't get another. Very well placed. It's Chile nil. Nigeria 2. Ngozi and Kobe, who has been used as a striker, far more being used as one of the three midfield players. We'll keep an eye on just what the... Ooh, 
Look at the little back heel to set Ayila away. And from there, look at the little back heel to set Ayila away. And from there, it was a calm finish. The sequence is to keep it low, close to the keeper's legs. And that's exactly what she did. Just leaping out of the danger there was Ofeo Bull. The challenge came in from Ariagada. It's been a little bit... And that was good work too from Aido. But Nigeria can look to get forward again. Here's Ofeo Bull. Ayila plays it in. Good defending makes sure that Ordega can't gather. Well, that ultimately, you have to say, is a poor cross at the end of it all. You know, overall, you'd also say that's a very good ball. And Ivoria keeps the move going. Ayila's touch just too heavy. But it was all started by a Luko's ball. 17 minutes World Cup. Adelomon. Well, Nigeria 3 0 up and. Sweet play from Nigeria and an opportunity for goal number four and a hat trick for Love Ayila. Well, when they get these passing moves really working for them, and Nigeria really do take some stopping. The number eight, Zipeda. Let's have another look at the goal. Well, it's, again, it's just a lovely pass from Okobi, who's been a real star tonight. And Ayila completes her hat-trick. All three changes have now been made. Player, slightly more worrying for Nigeria is the fact that Chioma Alimba has limped off and is currently receiving treatment on the... And if they keep going backwards, they are going to be in trouble. I don't think that's quite what she meant. Rather scuffed that. This could be dangerous. Love it, It's actually very good defending from a forward player in Judith Rojas. who got back wonderfully well just to get a... Oh, we don't want to get caught in possession there. And Camila Seiss has been. Oh, the shot on goal was a little bit snatched by Ayila. And the danger passes. But Camila Seiss, got to be careful there. On the other hand, we may not, and Nigeria confirm their place as winners of Group A. Nine points out of nine for them. And a hat-trick for that player, Love Ayila of Adama. Defending in Arima, Chile nil. Nigeria five. Ayila in on goal. And Ayila makes it to well, the little ball forward from Francisca Ortega was the key to this goal. But it wasn't a bad finish either from Lovet Ayila of Adamaya Queens. Oh, she's got a really good goal against Trinidad and Tobago. Smalley, they call her. And Lovet Ayila has now got her second of the tournament. Oh, that's a beautiful little back heel to create an opportunity for goal number three. Well, when Nigeria work it well, they really can be dangerous. 
and they move on to three for the game with another goal for Lovethavi Ayila. Sweet play from Nigeria and an opportunity for goal number four and a hat trick for Love Ayila. Well, when they get these passing moves really working for them, and Nigeria really do take some stopping. And again, Scarborough Tobago, it's Nigeria that get us underway then. All in white. Kick it from right to left in the first half. Laura Schmidt helped on by Okobi. It's good play again from Nigeria. Only one in the centre though. Oh, it's come all the way across to Ayinde. Running in the end from Kadira Devaset. The Hines just loses out and picked up again by Okobi. Up Nigeria once more. Very, very skillful when they've got the ball at their feet. Oh. Gobi's in the centre. Teams will have one more group game left. Find his way to Akinbay now. Cross curl in towards the near post. The ball spins loose in Nigeria. will score, in fact, it won't count. It's disallowed. Referee spotted some pushing. Well, the ball came in. Love Athalia. Finish, but the Austrian referee had spotted some pushing in the centre. There's a good ball in from Akinbay. Was it handball? Not too sure what the referee's seen there, but the goal's disallowed. It won't count as Loveth Aliyah. Maybe a foul by Francisca Ordega as she went across. That the performance at the weekend wasn't by chance. It was a win won by hard work, and they might take the lead. Here's a great save again by Linfa Jones. Denied Loveth Aliyah. Again, though, Trinidad shot the top of the bar this time. Goalkeeper's lost it, it's in the drop behind. Well, two excellent efforts. Aluchi off Igbu with a second one, which cannoned off the top of the bar. Linfar Jones making an excellent first save from Aliyah. Oh, I love it, Aliyah. Kemi Abiodun will play it forward again. Here come Nigeria once more. Ayila. Waiting in the centre. Devaset gives the ball away. Here's another chance. Ayila. Good save by Linford Jones. It's a poor defending again by the home team, and they've got away with that one thanks to the goalkeeper. Love it, Ayila with a shot. Good save by Jones, and as you come into the side tonight, Ayala. Here's a Kobe. Now Ayala. Here's Ayala. That's a good challenge. That Patrice Vincent. That pace has been a problem all night so far for Trinidad and Tobago, but Patrice Vincent making a good clean challenge on the Republic lost to England and drew with Brazil, but that wasn't enough unfortunately to see them through. So they're looking for progression for the quarterfinals this time. She's told by her uncle that they were looking for players for the Trinidad team and she was happy to play for her adopted country. Here's Ortega. That's another. Kayla Taylor back helping out in defense. Kobe down the line again looking for the pace of Ordega. But she's done well to get the ball across. Jones got a hand to it to turn it over the bar. It was a good save in the end. Ordega just managed to keep that in, did very well to get the cross in. Just managed to get away from the challenge of Patrice Vincent.
favourite players, Diarra Simmons, who will celebrate her 15th birthday in three days' time. One of the younger players in the tournament. Ball through. Away by Schmidt. A Delamont. Ayla. She's done well. Three waiting in the centre. Right the way across. It's over the keeper. And Nigeria score. Loveth Aliyah gets the goal. Well, again, she was completely unmarked in the centre when that ball came in. And all of a sudden, the Mani Ramjohn Stadium is plunged into silence apart from the small pocket of Nigeria fans just down below. Free header. Good cross in. It was over the goalkeeper and the downward header puts Nigeria back in front for the second time. It's Loveth Aila with a goal. And they could well have snatched this one. Nigeria lead Goal for by two Nigeria. goals to one. Ayla, the goal scorer. Michael Goldie, which they can, well on the way to a place in the quarterfinals. It was a disappointing end for her particularly, but a very good night for the Nigerians. Despite the sellout crowd here in Marabella, the Trinidad and Tobago team lose their opening game. It was Loveth Elia. Francisco Odega put them in front. But then Loveth Ayla with a goal near the end. And the night in the end, and they go through, through to their final game after another victory. It's finished Trinidad and Tobago 1, Nigeria 2.